Good morning, everybody. We, we about to get that, uh, you know, the breakfast started, get this morning going. You know, God bless us. We both woke up. Uh, today, what we having, uh, Miss Swagger? Please? We having potatoes, turkey sausage, eggs and cheese. And we got to say that and biscuits. You mm. got to have a biscuit. Mmm, sounds good. Sounds and potatoes. good. Potatoes. Potatoes. Yeah. Okay, now, yeah, you said it, baby. Now, I'm about to go here to the wall because I don't think that we get to show this much, but this is like, uh, what we call this, baby? Family collab. A family collab. So, let me get y'all a little V. Yeah, y'all should see that. I'm going to go through it. And now, you know, you got to be family to make this list now. Think about it. This is facts talk, yeah. Just face talk. You gotta be family to make this list now. It's not a game. Well, wife for paying, getting you know the stuff we need to make this blessed meal. How many of y'all had a blessed Christmas? Huh? And ain't ready for that New Year's. I advise everybody they got goals that they trying to fulfill. 2022. All I ask you to do is apply pressure. All me and my wife ask you to do is apply pressure. Yeah. Cause you know, we try not to hate on this side of town. Yeah, I'm still giving y'all close up of the family collage, you feel me? Like I said, only family make this, uh, this, 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 this section right here. No disrespect to nobody. But it just is what it is. This is facts though. Sure, y'all get a good, good close up of it. Yeah, I want y'all to get that thing good so y'all can know what the deal is. Mm -hmm. What the deal is. Right there on her fall side. Now, here we go over here. Now, she's doing everything from scratch, like the potato. She should, the potato person should sign her to a million dollar contract. Cause I'm not saying it because it's wife, but her potatoes be off the chain. Like for real, I don't really even like eating that kind of stuff. But when she put them things on, put that there uh, uh, onions and stuff all up in it, man. Yeah, she do it from the ground up. You know we homegrown over here. We like to do everything. We trying to be self millionaires. You feel? Like my wife say, we gonna be millionaires. <laughs> y'all know how. Y'all know how we sway. <laughs> Life and death is in the power of your own mm -hmm. tongue. You know that's why a lot of these rappers dying too. Cause they talk, I believe they talk that stuff on them. What you think? Life and death is in the power of your own tongue. Yeah, a lot of these rappers boys seem like they talking that stuff on them, you know what I mean? But yeah, we just, you know, about to get this day started. The kids still asleep. Come on, walk with me. We get back over there. We still got this little nice little tree up. What y'all think about it? Let us know in the comments. 
this presser right here, why you can put that thing together, you know it's been tough by Miss Swag Queen. Mm-hmm. And also check out uh you know Miss Swag from Purple Sky Boutique at www.purplesky.boutique.com to get that press. You know why you got some press. But yeah, we just thankful to be alive. Woke up this morning. Another beautiful blessed day. Thanks to the good Lord of high power. <laughs> you feel me? Not to sound all preachery type, but you know it is what it is. This right here, Big Mom. I just feel like this morning was important to do this. It's basically like we give them flowers to the people that need them. Look at Big Mom. Now, this my wifey right here, baby. Here, fast dog. That's Big Mom there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. God bless her soul. Here you go, oh, Big Mom. Yeah. God bless her soul. She out there chilling with Weezy. Google real child, you know her folk. Be fast. Pain free, fast though. Let's get back over here. You know, it was just right after Christmas, so I'm still on that good, you know, looking out for the ones who matter the most fast. New Year's about to come in. What y'all gonna do for New Year's? What, what's your New Year's resolution, baby? Trying to think about it. I ain't even asked. And keep it 1,000. I'm just trying to be better than I was in 2020 and over the rest of the year. Now, I'm that, trying to stay focused. I'm trying to accomplish all my goals. Have a closer relationship with God. That's so. Even though we already got a close relationship. That's so. But I'm just trying to maintain. You hear me? Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to survive. Mm -hmm. That's what it's all about when, nowadays. So when, when you want to get the, uh, the matter of fact, we already got you already got some of that material for the uh, what's that boy you call, baby? The we already knocked, yeah, we already knocked that other one now. We, uh, we got the material. We got to up, we got to upgrade. Yeah, so we can do a new vision board. Yeah, so yeah, 2022. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So y'all stay tuned in on that. Y'all will see that maybe probably not on the next episode, but the episode after that, but. Yeah, I will see about it. It's called a uh, vision board. Vision board. So you mm -hmm. guys, vision boards are so important because what you're doing is you're manifesting what you want. You're manifesting. You putting it on the board. You putting it in pictures. Mm -hmm. Bring, bring in your vision to life. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So that's important. Cause I believe you should do a vision board at least every six months. That way you Especially see. Especially when the new year comes in. Mm -hmm. That's where you will see where you reaching your goals and accomplishing them or not, you know. So I agree with you on that one, Miss Bay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree with you on that one. For real. Mm -hmm. Now. Y'all, y'all already know she, uh, Miss Lady already washed her hands now, cause, cause you know some people be shooting these videos. You know I don't like to say no name, but I know that they don't wash their hands. And I, when I say wash your hand, I mean like really put like soap and stuff on your hand and or put it on there and let it sit for a minute before you just go right back to putting it on there and rinsing it off. You know, cause you know it kills germ and that is important. Like I don't know if y'all see or. Oh, it was that bleach, we had that bleach bottle over there in the cup because you know wife like the bleach thing down. She don't need to play like uh matter of fact, I'ma show I'ma hit y'all to these whites that y'all can get. These right here. These, so you know, they 99%. It ain't a it ain't a hundred, but you know, hey, what can you ask? You, you, it is what it is, you know. But these the uh, whites you wanna get. You see why you got that green tea on deck here. Green tea is very important. The reason why I say green tea is very important because it play a big role with your heart system, your immune system, and you know your immune system got to be on point to beat that COVID-19. And you also know me and my wife also surviving COVID-19 for the people who don't know already because we put a clip in our, uh, our already about that. What you what you what you got to say about that baby five being a Corona? Uh, 19 survival. Man, it's just a blessing, but I believe they put it out in the air. Mm. It's a lot of people get sick with COVID, and there's no way all these people just got sick out of nowhere. Mm. You know, I uh, uh, just watch where y'all go. Keep your hands clean. Keep your mask on. 
don't be around a lot of people because it's serious. Mm -hmm. And you know, it's, it's, it's crazy to me how if you look nowadays on Netflix or any of these channels, it ain't nothing but like a virus kind of movie that they got. Like, and, and the crazy part about it, it's been out before the virus situation. Because if I'm not mistaken, the virus situation started when, when, when can I say, uh, the end of 2019? Okay, yeah, so it's like still fresh, if you ask me. And movies been on that, like dates 2012 and stuff like that. Me personally, I believe they be making these viruses. I don't care what nobody says. Mm. Mm -hmm. I know when I first heard about a virus is when I seen the China people trying to situation. kill the population because they feel like there's too many people in the world. Mm, that was just, oh, mm, that's, that, that, now if that's the case, that's something serious. Uh, baby, like on some real stuff. You wash your hands. You gotta be mindful where you go at. Keep your mask on. Keep hand sanitizer with you. I advise you just stay around the people that you live with. Because mm -hmm. if, if y'all look at a lot of our clippings, we keep that mask on. Like that mask is very important. I don't know how. And I got the virus from going to a, a job Christmas party. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. They don't got to worry about me attending another party. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. But I told you about that, baby, because it's a crap. See, you know, it's like. But you can't live in fear. That's I don't. I don't really say you're living in fear, but you still want to be on. You want to be cautious of, of yeah, your moves you, you make. Cautious. Because it can cause. Because you remember now, your own moves can cost the rest of the people uh, problems, fox kids and stuff like that. So I know you can't live in fear, but you do know what's going on, and it's just like to me, it's just common sense. So that's why I say that. <laughs> but I said you still gotta have fun. You still gotta yeah, have fun. You can have fun, but you, you just can't do it in a crowded situation. You just gotta be mindful. It's sad, you know. This is what the world has come to, but it is what it is. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Tony. Mm -hmm. So, whatever uh, New Year's resolution you got, baby? Because I'm gonna tell you what my, my I'm gonna tell you mine. Let me break mine down to you. Mine is the stay. Pray it up more. Yeah. Give people flowers more. I'm back. The camera don't stop. But anyway, my goal is to give people they flowers while they still alive, while their heart still breathing. Because I, 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 I believe we give people they flowers definitely when they gone. And I believe that's totally the wrong way to go about things. That's one of them. And to be more on health and to stay consistent and to stay on point with, with, with the goals that we trying to push far as your business situation, far as with your clothing line and the kids' clothing line. You know you the head of that department, you run that and that's your thing. So we wanna make sure we apply pressure with that and far as our YouTube channel, far as the Yellowton's family. I want us to get more greater content. I wanna switch it up. I wanna be different from the other YouTubers, you know? Cause a lot of, you see a lot of the YouTubers, they really do basically the same thing, which is cool cause it's working, it's paying the bill, it's putting food on the table, so I don't knock it. But I just want us to, you know, just bring it a little different and apply more pressure far as with the Yellowton yeah, YouTube you channel. No, no question about that, but I'm just telling you far as this new year coming in. We got to apply stronger pressure. I, that, that's what I should have said. That's the word I want to use. Apply stronger pressure. How about that? I think that'll work, you know. And I also want to, you know, get more, can get the kids more, you know, content far with the Jaden Zaza show, which we are doing. Man, check that out. We also just dropped two episodes uh, yesterday to be exact. So y'all go on uh, the Jaden Zaza show and check their stuff out on YouTube. It ain't hard to do. You know that your kids, if you ain't tuned subscribe if you ain't subscribed to the uh, situation mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you can't comment unfortunately because youtube turns old comments and i, I agree with doing that because you got a lot of crazy people you got pedophile you got everything that might leave some crazy sick kind of stuff behind so i don't even knock youtube on that situation but yeah we just you know getting getting this uh this breakfast ready uh about to eat a blessed meal uh you know, think, talk a little bit. You know, it's raining out there, so rain is slow a little things out. Uh, far as what we had planned with me anyway, so, you know, we'll fall back, relax, eat this good meal, go over, uh, shoot some more uh, footage of, uh, you know, the Jaden Zala show and our stuff, you know, because, you know, it's still like, like when we not working, we still working. You know what I'm saying? That right, uh, but. <laughs> 
when we not working, we working. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, like I told you, we playing present with the content here. Like, we want to bring it, you know. We want to we wanna, uh, get this message out. Because, you know, a lot of our things is based on reality and the real. Exactly. The, the real. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I want to hit y'all now. My wife, her side of the family, on her father's side, they are health freaks. I mean, real health freak, and ain't nothing, it ain't a bad thing, it's a beautiful thing. I just thought I'd throw it out there, and they got us going drinking this water right here. Now, the only thing I'm trying to open the freezer radio, because the freezer radio, you know, heavy, because I know y'all probably like, oh, they trying to uh, show the freak. Nah, it ain't about that, because you know the free, this freezer radio be open when it ain't, when it's like a skinny kid, and not looking like no uh, fat kid now. Keep it real now. You know, we like to keep it real, but this the water, excuse me. This right here, the Alkaline 88. This right here is precious. Now, when we went out in North Carolina, because you know my uh, wife, uh, folks, she got folks out in North Carolina as well as myself. You know, we got a lot of roots out there. But anyway, every time I go over her uncle house, uh, which one, what, what's the name again, baby? Uncle uh, Kurt. Kurt, yeah, yeah, damn, Kurt, man. You know I smoke that marijuana, and where I'm from, it's illegal, so y'all gotta excuse me about no, I said it's legal, yeah, it's legal where we at, so, you know, but sorry about that Kurt Bone, you feel me? But this right, when, when we go there, this is the water that's always be in there. He always, when he get a glass of water, ask him, do I want a glass of water? I see him use his jug. But get this water in your household, it plays a lot of role with everything. It's just good. Man, we got one of our little ladies done blessed and woke up. We got that deer park in there too, you know. We still a fan of the deer park, but we really on this water right here, especially since my wife's family hit us to it. We've been on it. Okay, she done got the, she done did, man. See right here? This how you know a woman dollar business and she specialty, like I say, with this. You see how she got them? See this right here? She got them clearing all the dirt and stuff off her. So you know this play a big role when you cooking because you can get hypnotized as well as a bee or something. And she getting her tea together. She getting that tea together. Already got the lemon and the honey in it. So yeah, yeah, I see the specialty. She used green tea, honey, and ginger. Yep. And lemon. Ginger and lemon. See the best? These bitches ain't hard to find, you heard? Look at that, turkey sauce. Now we don't do beef and we don't do pork. Now we don't knock the next. But we trying, we not trying to run like that. I'm gonna tell you now, eating a lot of beef it gives you uh, colon cancer. Because a lot of that meat is harder to digest and you got two intestines. You got the uh, small intestine and the large intestine. The small intestine is where most stuff get trapped in and be hard to digest. So you might eat a burger the day and probably still have that same burger in you this same time next month so that's 30 days later not for real baby it's like it's hard to digest so that's why a lot of people get cold and cancer because the, the meat rats in you and once it rats in you that will really be a, a main trigger for cold and cancer so that's why it's important to like you know to eat like they say you all what you eat that stuff is real baby mm -hmm. that's fast talk so that's why it's important, like to like to take like stuff to uh, you know fast and to digest. Uh, you know them stuff that make you use the restroom and stuff flush you out. It's good to take that, you know, because a lot of times our bodies be needing it. So I try to stay away from that. Well, we try to stay away from that. The beef process, a lot of stuff that's processed. You got a microwaveable stuff. Mm -hmm. Steak was one of my favorite favorite steak shrimp. Yeah, man, I'm talking about, and then we put that steak down, because you know you got to beat that steak like a punching bag. So if you don't, it might rip your teeth out your gums. <laughs> yeah, <baby. laughs> it, might, it might rip your teeth out your gums if you don't beat that joint right. So you got to beat that steak. Yeah, but it's family all on this picture here, though. I just like this. Idea. Wife came up with this idea and we wanted to be set right in the kitchen so when people come over, we rent it. Yeah, we want we, we want to let it be known this is what it is, you feel me? Yeah, fast talk. Yeah, you made this 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 chalk right here. 
You hear? Right. You made this chart right here. When the Lord bless us financially wise, we trying to help these people's situation. Yeah, I'm saying it early yeah. They said, why you say you got to talk it in existence, then you buddy? Why not? Why not? I like to talk that in there. Don't live Auntie Lulu. This little lady right here was a good soul. A good soul. Then we got Big Mama right beside her. Another good soul. Wow. God bless the real. Yeah. Look at that for Look at me. Yeah. God bless the real. Look at that. Look at DeAndre when he was a young boy. Yeah. Hey, that's back when he was young boy. That's back when country party was swooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooooo
visit Master Purge. When the visit line open, she was head first. Well, so I don't think twice. We're gonna get right back at you at a second, let y'all see. Well, hope a you know, no the other stuff we got going on for us with the breakfast meal. And that way, maybe uh, Jade and Zaza and them might be there for Dwayne and one of them, you know. But we'll be back. Y'all just stay tuned. Peace. And that's what it, this is what, what we got going on. Mmm. See that season juice in there? Mmm. And that's what you call a beast breakfast. Why pay when you can make your own? <laughs> Think about it. What you think, boy? <laughs> you agree? It's gonna be good, and I agree. <laughs> <laughs> and please let these people know you ain't agreeing just because you're my wife, no. baby. <laughs> I no told you. I can cook some good breakfast. Facts talk. Well, we just wanted to let y'all see what we were, where we was headed at, but we get right back with you. Stay tuned in. We back at it. Still got them things getting ready. The sauces. They out the they out the pan. I'm gonna let y'all see that when everything's done. But I'm gonna show you the head. Now see, I ain't wanna show y'all the recipe because like I said, it costs. So if you wanna know the recipe how to make your egg, just put it in the comments. Hit the DM. Me and wife will get back to you. And I give you the recipe to get them yellow fluffy cheesy eggs. You will see at the end of it. Uh, my baby girl Jay, she woke up, but she must have went back to bed. But we will let y'all see that final touch though when everything's done. It's raining outside. It's one of them like messy kind of days. One of them yeah, that too. I'm talking about like if you, if you the type that gotta go out there or be out there, you know, if you have to work today, you know, if it's one of the messy kind of days, one of the days you gotta be very cautious when you drive. That's that weather. Well, it's raining all night. Yeah, I, it's raining. Usually I can feel when it's raining. For some reason, I didn't feel it raining. Like, it ain't feel like it was raining. Damn, man, it's I didn't feel it. I wouldn't know if you wouldn't have said nothing about it. I remember you telling me that it was raining. Mm -hmm. I look outside. It's, just, it's raining cats and dogs out there. Real mess. The earth needs to be clean. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Last talk. <laughs> this woman is crazy, y'all. Yeah, when the swag queen. She be tripping me out. She also make, make, make the day for me, you know what I mean? Like, this woman here something else. This woman a real piece of work. But, you know, I wouldn't trade in for a suitcase full of money. Saeed. <laughs> you think I'd trade you in for a suitcase of money, baby? Keep it 1,000, man. Don't fake it. Money coming up. Yeah, so, but, but, do you, if you know. That money ain't even going to last. Yeah. That money ain't even. You know, you ain't, it ain't no value on it. You feel me? So, if it ain't no value on the money means nothing. Like, it's no value. Can't nothing. You know what I mean? Fast up. Taste almost done. Biscuits almost done. I'm starving like mom. Sausage is done. I ain't even gonna lie. I do whip the eggs up. I already got them whipped up. I just gotta basically you know put them on the thing. You know, you people, you always cook eggs last. Always cook eggs last. Yeah, so they can be hot. Red. Where you going, woman? You trying to go relax your soul. <laughs> this one, what she call? She trying to relax your soul. What a remote. Yeah, like we sent. Yeah, like we can't hear. Uh, anyway. <clears throat> What's this right here, boo? Oh, man. I ain't even trying to watch it because I'm cooking. Mm. When I blew trout, I mean, you stood there. Not even a passive, you tell me that it's not real. It's called burning. Mm. So, we just sitting back relaxing. And it's nice morning. <laughs> <laughs> Jay, what you think? Jay went back to sleep? Yeah, she ain't 
Yeah, Jay, you probably went to sleep. Jay, you probably wanted to sleep. Jay, you probably wanted to know what all that noise was, you know, like people yeah. up. What's y'all favorite movie on Netflix? Put it down. Oh yeah. Put it down in the comments. Let us know what, what, what what's the show to watch. Let us know some shows to watch on this rainy day. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. What time do you think it is without looking at it, bro? Like the, you can sometimes feel the time. <laughs> uh, I don't know, let me see. Then I say seven something. So you write seven twenty. Seven twenty. Yeah. 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 But you wrote too far off on. It is about around about the eight eight o'clock kind of feeling vibe. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The sun is shining and I'm loving it. <laughs> <laughs> If, we, if he wouldn't have made breakfast, I probably would have made us a smoothie breath. Cause you know we do the little smoothie thing too. I got the ice, I got the ice ready. I will do that smoothie thing. Give me some iron in me. You feel me? Banana is a pork. Play a big role. Overall hell. What'd you say, baby? Mm. Mm. Oh, that's right. And you know another thing that we do is, you know, we make smoothies like we try to do that like every morning. Like if we don't cook a, a meal like this, we do the smoothie because the smoothie is important because you gotta get that in. Like berries. Blueberries, strawberries, bananas. So we do all that. I'm talking about real fruit. Oh. Uh, I don't think it was raining that hot to where where it got wet, cause the tent got it uh, secured. This weather was crazy out here, boy. You know we fly out there in VA. Out there like. You think we in the country all the time. Yeah, well, like I was saying, but now it's good for the cows from the eyes. Some people need it for our blood work. I'm gonna be on point. And you need some iron in your system, so it played a major role. What we gonna start doing is uh, doing vegetable smoothies. I know that gonna be nasty, because me, I don't know if y'all know this or not, but Everything that's good for you is really nasty. Not saying everything, but majority of the stuff that's good for you is nasty. Like beats play a very, very important role with you. And I can't stand beats. Beats play a good, beats you play a good role with. I never taste them. I don't like them. So I don't know how they taste, but they See how them potatoes getting that brown as look, that gold brown? That's when you know it's about ready. Mm-hmm. But you say you don't like beets, baby. I ain't got to taste them, but they look nasty and expensive. Oh, they nasty. Nice. I know some people who drink beet juice. Yeah, good for it. Play a role with your heart and your blood. And other little beneficial factors that, that, that uh, beets curry. Especially if it's, it's raw, because you know a lot of stuff that's not raw coming from the plant is really getting uh, stepped on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. With extra stuff getting added on to it so it's not pure, it's not raw. Mm -hmm. so always wash the stuff you use to cook food with y'all to prepare food with. To play a role, to keep you from getting hepatitis, I believe, D. Now nah, I think it's beef, and I think uh, usually like the head but tight, I, I believe if I'm not lying, I mean if I'm not saying the wrong thing, I'm telling the lie. 
I believe it's supposed to uh, attack the liver. You know, anything that attack any like main organ like that, it can be a daily issue. Liver, heart, all that muscle. Cause you know, heart ain't nothing but a muscle. A muscle vessel. Okay. Brain. You take it, you eliminate any one of them. You in trouble. And I always have a clean kitchen when you preparing food. I always clean while I'm cooking. So that way, once you finish cooking, you don't got that much to clean up. So while you're cooking, you clean as you go because it make it easier for you. And anyway, I can't clean in a dirty kitchen. No, you mean you can't eat cook in a dirty kitchen. Yeah, yeah. Y'all get the picture. I can't cook in a dirty kitchen. And I can't eat in a dirty kitchen. Thanks, talk. She's My telling kitchen you the truth. She's not play. And I have to clean while I'm cooking. And I find so any like meal up, like figure that's hot. watching this episode. Get you a woman like this too. That's well, big on cleaning because that, that plate of rolls. And once I'm finished using it, I have to wash it, it out. It shows a lot about a person. Oh, In other words, my man, mm -hmm. my, man. <laughs> my kids, my house, nothing. So how you think the uh, 2022 will turn out? Like, like if you see it in your vision, well, how you think? One of the best years of our lives. I, I hope so, cause you know, man, 2002. Yeah, 2002. It was just a fast talk. 2002 was a bad year. 2020. One was a bad year. 2020 was a bad year. But we survived. No question. But I'm just the like. Crazy part is, it's like when you're going through stuff, you think like, "Dang, I ain't gonna never get out of whatever I'm going through. I ain't gonna never be happy again." Or this happened and that happened. Mm -hmm. When you're going through, you have so many mixed emotions. But look at everybody who's been through stuff this year. And not only that, you got people. You got people going through stuff worse than your situation. Yeah, true. Mm -hmm. Somebody is always doing better than you, doing worse than you, going through something worse than you. You know, worse than worse, right? <laughs> always somebody just gonna be on top of you, and somebody gonna be at the bottom of you. You might think your situation is terrible, but there's somebody out here who wish they can be in your situation. Right. Right. So through it all, y'all, we just got God first. We got to pray, 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 pray. Pray our way through trauma. Mm -hmm. I agree. I agree. I agree. Mm-hmm. J.D. J. Yeah, my baby went back. You said it was J because I didn't even see who I thought it was Zaza. Mm -hmm. mm. It's real messy out there. to the pan so you got to get these good pans right here these are some that uh, I got wifey for Christmas this was one of her Christmas gifts was a good pot section with a lot of stuff in it uh, it don't stick now this egg I can't tell y'all what I use to make my egg because I told y'all charge for it you know nothing in life is free for real it shouldn't be that way but it is what it is I ain't gonna hit your pockets though, you'll get you some good yellow fluffy eggs. Thanks, so. Watch me, I see the outcome of the eggs. The eggs will be pressing. Make sure you don't guide it up too high. 
I put now, I, I, I advise you not to use butter. I use a little bit of butter, a tinsy bit, like just enough to get the pan together. I didn't use, I, actually I took the rest of the butter out of it. I just needed, the pan to have a little butter on it. And like I say, if you're a person that got high cholesterol levels, don't even worry about this meal I'm making right here. This is not the option for you. You know, I'm gonna keep it real with you at all times. Baby, tell him about this the egg, baby. Tell him how fresh it is. I ain't lying, y'all. His eggs fresh and you didn't. Well, baby, you always be want me to cook the egg. When I tell y'all his eggs be nice, fluffy, and soft. Mm -hmm. And everybody think eggs easy to make. Mm -hmm. like, some people eggs. make their eggs hard. I'm going to tell you who got the worst of eggs from fast food, McDonald's. Oh, yeah. McDonald's got the worst of eggs, y'all. Man, yeah. I think McDonald's put their eggs in the microwave. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm talking about the scramble eggs. I don't don't be like scramble kind of eggs. Be tasting like you eating plastic eggs, eggs that'll be on the uh the kids I play with out the store to use for their kitchen set or something. <laughs> I'm just keeping it real, y'all. I ain't hating that, but it's facts talk. So if you are a McDonald's fan, you know what I'm talking about already. It ain't no seat. It ain't like I ain't telling y'all something y'all don't know. That's why you go right to the bed, the bed, the restroom so fast. I think all them fake mom them fast. Nah, uh, Burger King got good eggs. Uh, I don't think so. Scramble, I, I, well, I like it. I, do. I don't like the eggs either. Yeah, I like the eggs. Burger King got good eggs. Uh, uh, how, uh, what's that, uh, the one they bought the bill? Uh, of course, I know. I, 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 I know, of course, because you can eat. Uh, no, nah, but I hope you got some good eggs. Ben man didn't. What about what you think because about? Those like breakfast spots. What you think about Bob Evans? Nah. Cracker Barrel got some good eggs. Yeah, I agree. Cracker Barrel got some good uh, chicken scrimps too. But well, what is chicken scrimps? Chicken scrimps. Man, them things is banging. You remember when we got some? And their pancakes good too. Yeah, I like their pancakes. They got them thick, fluffy, for real, man. They is better than uh, I hop to me. Mm -hmm. They got like a sweet taste to it. Who do you think got the best egg on um, Man, you know I love egg on Y'all see how it's coming together? So we'll be back, y'all. We'll show y'all the finished time. Facts talk. Facts talk. Now, these are the eggs done. You see how fluffy and orange yellow they look? And they thorough cook. Let me let y'all get a glimpse of it. Look, cheese on it and everything. Now I'm gonna take y'all back over here to where wife is over here. Getting them fruits together. Mmm, great, seedless great. Mmm-hmm. Look at them bits. Them bits are like commercial. Look at them potatoes, you see the little light brown on it? Get it like 14 carat gold. Soft. Got that fruit going on. You know we trying to eat the live in this household and I advise you to do the same in your household. Mine is the scrambled eggs and cheese, y'all. Mine is that. Because you know, I honestly believe it's bad for people with heart situation and high cholesterol level. Stay away from this. But that's how them fluffy eggs look. Look, you can fold go right through without getting stuck. <laughs> you hear me, buddy? <laughs> I probably make these people home. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that stuff together, buddy. Thanks, though. Yeah, how many wood showers over here right now that's looking? Don't lie. Because if I was looking at this on your YouTube channel, I'd be telling my wife, let's go make something to eat. That food looks so good and people don't. Mm-hmm. Look at that. Look at the sauce with them onions in it. Ooh, we. You know, my kids look at these as burnt. They don't know them the good ones. They ain't burnt. That's how they supposed to be cooked. Gotta have a little bit of Obama. In the back, in the middle, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Plus I dig your style and the way you move. Fuck anything. You think we gonna have a, a bad snow this winter? I don't know. I don't know. We really had no bad one in a minute. It's about that time. When the last time was it? When it was a bad one? I don't even recall. Uh, we did snow last year. I believe 2018, 2019 was the last bad one. I believe one of the years, if I'm not mistaken. Mistake. Remember that blizzard we had? What well, year was it up? Was it 96 or 98? Oh, I remember that. You talking about way back. You talking about that yeah, far back. It's been a joint that was bad. Yeah, that's the worst one, but it's been some that was more, uh, I mean, that was bad. Almost as that before that. You talking about way back. I remember that one. Uh, 2016? Nah, I believe it was 1918. No. No, I think it was 2016 or 15 over that. Because I remember we had a rock in the snow. You couldn't move the car. That's that, that what you call a bad snow. The field can't even be operated. Buses got to shut down, everything. There was, the whole city was shut down. Mm. I think that was like... Oh, I remember that one. That thing was crazy. We had to walk in the snow and everything. We had to walk to the store. I don't even think no stores was open. Nah, it was stores open. It just you had to walk to. You just couldn't get you couldn't drive. Now that you got one of them vehicles, had them big, uh, credible hot wheels, chains, and all that stuff on. Them. Yeah, we was snowed in. We was, we was hiking. Oh, yeah. But you know, we some soldiers, so it ain't bad. Yeah, I thought the snow was gonna never. Mm hmm Yeah, buses. You know, whenever bu metro buses start running, it's bad. You know what I mean? Buses don't want you even want to operate in that stuff. They ain't trying to get no lawsuits because they know it will be a lot of bus accidents. Mm -hmm. So that's why they do that <laughs> Oh, the break. Getting that fruit bowl together. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You know how much this one bowl right here played with your immune system? Not just your immune system, but I just say the immune system because I want you to get hip because that played a big role with the coronavirus. It helped you fight that better in other ways some people lose the fight with it because of the immune system yeah, or they got breathing situation yeah mm -hmm. don't forget to use that mask y'all when y'all in public allergies it's for real even though the tv might not televise it as much as they would but it's still real man these people crazy because do you know they're talking about um People with COVID, they first the days was 14 days, then they took it down to 10. I think they don't really know for real. They just go five days. Can't nobody no, yeah, they, they, they want you to get back into the workforce, so the people want to keep paying exactly. for sitting home off the coronavirus. And they don't know they just jeopardize the other people inside that workforce that you bring back because you're not fully done. With treatment for real, off and over, just no five days. The 14 days, I don't even believe accurate. I believe it gotta be at least 90 days in that process. Two months to two, two, three months, 90 days, I believe. At least two months. They only be a whole 30 days and want you right back. Well, that's the meal, the egg, orange juice, the real orange juice. Look at that there. I want to say shout out to Miss Swagger Queen. You did an excellent job, wife. Real tough. As, as usual. I don't know why I'm sounding like it's a new thing. Always check and make sure the oven and stuff is off. So you won't have a crazy electric bill. So also run house fast. That's fast talk. We uh, we going to get these kids ready to get last with this meal, and we shall return. Probably step up a step. What y'all in here doing? Y'all think you trying to eat the cheese? Y'all stop playing. 
Why you up here showing off all the herbs now? You finna? Go ahead downstairs. Get ready for breath. Off we go. So did y'all dream of this? What about you, little lady? What you dream about, Lala? Go ahead, sit down until your feet food get prepared. The lady ready to eat it, yeah. Did you have a good sleep? Morning, Jay. Jay, you're What'd you say, baby? You said you ain't ready to eat. Which one? Go tell the Wayne. Grace. Da -da. You know you touch that and you ain't say your grace. Say your prayer, baby. Y'all fruit cups. Yeah, yeah. Go get the wings, Tell him come get this meal. No, he probably still knocked out because he, uh, Mm-hmm. What you look like that for, Jay? Oh, my bad, baby. <laughs> Zaza, you was hungry, baby. You went straight to work. No hesitation, man. She usually grabs juice before food. So that's why I know she knows she's hungry. And do you know she snuck, snuck with that, that bread that I put on the thing? I woke up, that joint was gone. That cause she got nothing but snacks. She ain't get no real food yesterday. Did you, little lady? Look at me, Zaza. Look at the camera. Did when you sneak and just eat nothing but junk food? That's why you were still hungry when you went to bed. Now you see why we keep a lot on her, cause she a big read. Matter of fact, we need a post with her wanting sign for snacks. <laughs> yeah, my little lady don't be playing by that car. And her prime and crime coming down the step. Jade, they hit that car, so it's another reason why we need a lock on the snack car. Ain't that right, Jade? Cause y'all will rob it blind. <laughs> mm -hmm. What you about to say, Jay? Jay's still a little sleep. You moved all the way up. Where's Dwayne? Dwayne coming? He's still sleeping. He was laying down. Mm. Mom over there working like she work at a fast food restaurant. Only thing I have got nothing on this one right now. Fast though. Yeah. Fast though. We, uh, we go, uh, go ahead and get to it. Yeah, fast though. We go. You know, catch up with y'all lady, y'all. Don't, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, uh, share, tell a friend, and tell a friend. And check out our other contents that we're going to be getting y'all with together with later on. Check out the Jaden Zaza Show. If y'all kids not already subscribed to their YouTube channel, please, I, I ask y'all, please, that y'all kids get tuned into what these little beautiful little kids of mine we got to offer. Also, don't forget you can shop at www.purplescapboutique.com to get your latest women and little girls wear. Jaden and Zyla got their own clothing line, so y'all can check that out. Also, at the same website on the same thing at Purple Sky Boutique. Also, don't forget to uh, check out all the new music and everything that I got that's out. I got the best kept secret on the way any minute now. I'm going to bring it in on 2022, so y'all get ready for that. Shout out to all the COVID-19 survivors. Shout out to everybody that had a blessed Christmas. Continue to stay blessed up and we out. Peace. Say bye, y'all. Bye. Mm -hmm. Say bye, baby.
Bye. <laughs> Y'all have a peace and a blessing. We out. The Everton family. Plus, I'm starving. Little lady eat all everything. I'm still tired. Hmm? I'm still tired. This is Miss Waste Food, y'all. Mercedes A. Dwayne gone crushing the left. That's what he's been up all night on that. Game and place today. Or whatever you call it. Game and PC. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hey, you can't go to school looking like this. Have you caught any trouble at school lately? Your teacher called him once. It ain't never been.